All right, well, <clears throat> hello. I'm coming out here. You probably wonder why I got this fence built. But we got chickens, four of them. The hairy little suckers. And I came out here to wrangle them, get them back in their home, close that door, but none of them are out. They're eventually gonna be free range. They might not be, I might just keep this thing. But I can leave that like that. We're gonna get some nice footage of me wrangling them. You see? They all just pop back in. Hey, chicka chick. They're all in there. They're starting to roost. They're going to bed. So, we're gonna free range them eventually. They're gonna be out here just to learn to be outside, even though they've been outside their whole lives. Well, we might as well just keep this here. It works pretty good. I don't need this. I don't know why it's going to still be there. Paulina's got his Oreos. We've got that right there and then this to push it down or else they'll escape. But they won't during the night. Our biggest threat is in the kittens. See, here we've got Einstein. Then Usain. Hi, Einstein. They roost on that wire here. I know, it's a mess in here. Your freaking animal rights people are gonna get get mad. Where's the third one? Where's the fourth one? I see three of y'all. Let's pop up in here. Got just chick $12 chicken food from the tractor supply. This will be my second attempt at chickens. Yeah, I only see three of them. Where'd the other guy go? Mm -hmm. I think. There's meant to be four here. We're missing somebody. Now, Paul, stay by that door. If they get out, we already know how impossible it is to catch them. But I don't think a cat stole them because that was a decent sized one. He's down there. He's probably under the board because that's the one we saw. They can roost up here. Yeah, there he is. Hey, chick, chick, chick. I'm just gonna flip this board over for you. Yeah, there he is. We've got four here. Yeah, because they were roosting the other night up here and there, there. We got food for them. It's okay, there's food. So this is where we tried chickens the first time long before I started YouTube. I love chickens. I've always liked chickens. I've always liked pigs, chickens, and cows. There he is. Just poking his head up over like, hey. So, that one's Einstein. The big one that will actually lay for us right now is um, Usain because she ran from us the other night when we first got him. And I haven't decided for the other two. That one's a Polish, the black and white one. Then the rest are Silkies got them from our aunt. My white one is we got, there's gonna, there's two sweet pea cows. Lisa's sweet pea and her baby's gonna be sweet pea. So I don't want to have two sweet peas. But yeah, also with this video, I don't know how shaky it's gonna be because I'm filming with this new stick. I've got a, kind of like a camera stand because I'm like, I'm not holding it, and I can set it up here. I'm not holding nothing. You can see me. It's pretty handy. It's for my birthday, which is coming up. I'm not going to say when. But yeah, I built... We got stuff done today. And, well, I'm going to let them sleep. And you can see them again another time. That one will lay. That one's you saying it will lay. We got the nesting boxes. Me and Dad built those this winter. And they can climb up right there and flutter over there. Because they, they're chickens, but they can do a bit of flying. And then got water right there. Got a bit of feed from Ant right here in the cheese ball container. Tomorrow, I'm going to have Dad and me after school go buy some wood chips and more food 
I don't really got much to say, so we got chickens. All right, Paul. Chicken. I will eat them. Huh? These are not meat birds. You cannot make munchies out of these ones. You can only get their eggs. You can go eat the eggs. You can learn how to eat eggs, Paul. Yeah. Eat anything. Yeah, I met, apparently I made this thing and discovered, I guess, first time we tried chickens, I had made another one of those, so it was pointless to make that one. But we used these things and just hooked it on there for the fence. And we used a spool of green fencing. It's in there. It's over here hooked up to the, to right here. So no animals should be able to get in unless they dig. But it's on the ground. They shouldn't be able to. And still, they're only going to be out here when I'm here. Because I'm the caretaker and love giver of these chickens. <clears throat> Need to replace that board right there. That is just falling apart. Six minutes. Six That's six minutes. If I was recording for six seconds, I would have just started. All right, well, I got kind of stuffed up. Well, that's all I had to say. We're using the electric. One of them just must have fluttered up onto the... It must be roosting. Just gonna go take another look here. Yep, they're getting up there. Once they, it's dark, they'll know it's nighttime and they'll open the door and they'll go to sleep. See, they're sitting up there. They can roost all over the place. One problem is this barn, they don't get much airflow, but they get some. It ain't a lot, though. So, now well, it's chickens. What more could you ask for? Well, you'll probably see videos of them. So we're getting, giving up pigs and going to chickens. Nice. Well, thanks for watching and goodbye.